Now we are going to see some applications of total internal reflection. Children, the phenomena of total internal reflection is very useful in the field of science such as totally reflecting prism. We'll see how they work, mirage formation and in medical field. The first I've drawn is deviation through 90 degree. The critical angle for the glass air combination is 42 degree. By experiment it was found out that is 42 degree and you need to learn it to know uh, to know how to draw these uh, diagrams. These diagrams are very very important. You need to literally learn it how to draw it so that there is no confusion regarding this. I will be telling you then you practice it and after that we will be doing the um, passage of the ray diagrams and everything together. The exercises we will do it together. So the deviation through 90 degree is suppose two light rays are coming one is like this okay when it is going parallel to this line let us name it as abc okay this is going to be perpendicularly coming down the other light ray moving here is again going to come down perpendicularly okay the angle here will be 45 okay so when it is 45 degree and the glass air critical angle is 42 degrees centigrade so the incident angle is greater than the critical angle and hence refraction ki jage, total internal reflection is taking place okay so ye light ray aise aa gai aur ye light ray aise aa gai because the angle of incidence is 45 degree and 45 degree is more than the critical angle the critical angle has to be 42 degree agar ye 42 degree ya usse niche strike kar rahi hoti agar 42 degree pe kar rahi hoti to ye line iske according chali jati or agar 42 se niche hoti to this would have been refracted but because of the property of glass what happens is that it is coming back that is it is being reflected in the same medium and here also it is falling perpendicularly so it is going straight so this way if the object is being viewed agar object aise hai now what happens the object is turned the head wali light is coming here so the head image is formed here and the object is turned by 90 degree aap aise dekh rahe the and the image aapko aise dikh rahi hai okay so the image is deviated through 90 degree and this is the diagram for it right so please draw it learn it how to make it now deviation through 180 degree okay we have kept our prism in this way right 45 degree the prism angle is 90 degree. Okay. So, the light ray coming here, ye aapka object hai. The light ray coming here is making an angle of 45 degree, which is more than the critical angle. Hence, it gets totally internally reflected. Here also, it is falling perpendicular and the angle of incidence is 45 degree and once again, it is suffering a total internal reflection. Okay. Similarly, for the other light ray. Coming from here, going here and then coming back from here. As they are striking and making an angle which is more than the critical angle. So they are suffering two times total internal reflection. And finally, this is the light ray which is making the uh, coming from the head part of it. And the, uh, and the image has been deviated through 180 degree centigrade. So this was the, uh, sorry, 180 degree, not centigrade. So this was the position of the omet, uh, object and this is the position of the image and it has been deviated by 180 degree. So again, the diagram becomes very important. Nothing uh, as theory you have to write it, only the diagram. Okay. 